Hey VIPs, it's Lexis Joy from Lexis Joy VIP Access, and I have the greatest, greatest honor of interviewing all of these geniuses, the voices behind one of my favorite shows, and now it's a movie on Nickelodeon. Hey Arnold, the Jungle Movie. Today I'm with the genius himself. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> Smart. <laughs> Craig Bartlett. Francesca Marie Smith. Andy McAfee. Benjamin Flores Jr. Uh, Mason Cotton. Yay. Now, this movie, I am at the edge of my seat. I can't wait to see it. So first off, can you tell us what it's like for you guys bringing this iconic show back to life in this awesome movie? Well, we wanted to do this movie about 15 years ago, and then the series got canceled. And unfortunately, the very last thing we had done was an episode called The Journal, an hour-long special, in which Arnold finds his dad's old journal, his missing mom and dad's old journal, <laughs> and there's a map in the very back and that's how the series ends with this cliffhanger. Grandma, Grandpa, I found a map. And uh, you expect him to immediately take that map and go find his missing parents. But then we had to wait 15 years. But you know, it's even better for the wait. I think this, this movie now, 15 years later, is even better than if we'd have made it then. I, you have no idea how excited I am. I'm like speechless because I can't wait for this. Now, do you guys have a favorite episode of Hey Arnold? Um, do you guys want to start? Jeez. <laughs> uh, uh, 202. <laughs> I like that one a lot. That one was really good. <laughs> it's really hard to pick a favorite episode because, you know, obviously all of them are important to us. But my personal favorite episodes are the ones where we get to see the relationship between Helga and Phoebe, where they have a moment where there's that... Helga tells Phoebe how amazing and special she, she is, or vice versa, and they have that, that really special friendship. I love those episodes. Amazing. Well, I have a lot of favorites. Um, <laughs> I, I like the ones that are really emotional and make you cry. Those are kind of my favorites. Um, I really like Helga on the couch because you, you, you've been following this kid for several seasons and all of her hijinks, and you're trying to figure out why she's such a bully and why she does what she does. And uh, this is one where you actually get to find out everything. You go all the way back to when she's a little toddler and where she first met Arnold in the first place. And it just, uh, it was one that I wanted to write for a long time and it took a long time to finally see the light of day. And it's, uh, you know, all Helga all the time. <laughs> I, I tend to, uh, it's very, very hard to pick favorites, but I, I tend to uh, have stronger memories about creating the episodes more than being able to sort of look at them objectively as, as you know, what they what they wound up being. Um, so for me, you know, I really, I really remember um, the Christmas episode and opera being a, a ton of fun to do. Um, I, I really liked Romeo and Juliet. There was, there was a whole lot around that and getting, getting to meet, uh, yeah, getting to meet Tim Curry was, was really fun. But also I think Helga on the Couch was, was a really nice, um, you know, combination of something that was meaningful at the time. It was really, it was fun to do. Kathy Baker was amazing. And it, it seems like I, I think it did come out well and, and resonate uh, with the Fans with the community too. So, yeah. Well, all of the episodes are absolute masterpieces. Again, yeah. we can see why everyone loves this show. Now, in the movie, Arnold sets out on a mission to find his parents. So what advice would you give to Arnold to help him out and be reunited with his family? <laughs> Arnold? <laughs> um, just stick with his friends and um, just, um, just stick with your buddies. Uh, never give up. Never give up. Ever. Oh, I thought I was going to think of something in the time that it took them to answer. But um, yeah. <laughs> have a really fun adventure doing it. I don't know with your pals. Yeah, it's different. Have fun. <laughs> Excellent. That's right. Don't forget to have fun. Um, yeah, I mean, when you think about it, the, it's, it's like a metaphor for this movie. You know, it took 15 years to make, and so I would say never give up hope. Always believe. Th those, are all, those are all really good. I feel like I should do the grandpa joke of never eat raspberries, but that's... <laughs> that's good. I like that. Yeah, we got some good themes there. Excellent. Now, also, if you could set out and on, on an adventure with any of the Hey Arnold characters, who would it be, and what adventure would you go on? Uh, I'd probably take Grandpa and maybe uh, try to catch a giant fish. That's what I'd do. Sounds fun. 
this is going to sound weird, but it's the first thing that came to mind. I, I would want to hang out with Helga, right? I, I do, there's just, there's, I, I have to sort of know what's going on. And the thing that came to mind, maybe from something we were talking about earlier, is I want to go looking at college campuses with her. I just, I really want to see, you know, what she's going to be and who she's going to yeah. grow into and the things that are meaningful to her. I don't know. Is that too sappy? No. And, and catch a fish. I don't know. I <laughs> I think I would definitely go on an adventure with Gertie because I love the unknown. I love being surprised. And I would definitely be surprised with her. Uh, honestly, I want to go with Arnold. Yeah, I think that would be cool because Arnold's a chill dude, so I think we'd have some chill vibes when we go. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'd want to go with Gerald, walk the streets of uh, New York, just chill out. <laughs> Thank you. Excellent. Well, that sounds like some fun adventures that you guys would go on. And throughout the show, and now in the movie, Arnold gets into a whole lot of adventures. So what is another adventure you'd like to see Arnold get into? You mean after this one? Yes. This is the biggie. Uh, after, the, <laughs> after this, maybe he takes like kind of a more chill vacation. Right. <laughs> and he's in a hammock somewhere you know, with a beach and, and, you know, I don't know, yeah. a little fishing. A little relaxation Relaxing after this fishing. one. Yeah. These are tough questions. <laughs> I don't. I, I did. I did really enjoy the, seeing seeing the entire crew outside of their natural environment and going someplace a little, you know, uh, uh, different for them. So I, I could see that we'll send them to Europe next, right? Just get some some, some, yeah. some of those fabulous, maybe like Venetian backgrounds yeah. or something. He's into architecture, so he'd really enjoy that. Yeah, I was actually thinking that when I like thought of this question, I was like, I want to see them go to Europe. <laughs> sure. Yes. Those were such good answers. I don't know what else to say. <laughs> High school. <laughs> That's the one I want to see. See? Yeah. <laughs> Uh, instead of the jungle, probably like um, the desert, like a Pyramids of Giza or something. Oh, man. <laughs> it's like no water. <laughs> it's going to be a little tough. And lastly, if you guys could bring out one message to all of your fans, what message would that be? Well, we already did never eat raspberries. <laughs> Um, yeah, uh, friendship's super important. Never, you know, never leave your friends behind. Always stick close to your friends and never lose hope. So, so is this like a, a, a lesson we want them to learn or like a message of, uh, I, because I, I think, you know, we're all so grateful. So, you know, thank you for, for everyone who has, who has been there and who has collaborated with this. And, uh, you know, enjoy, celebrate. This is this is something that's been a long time coming, and I, I think it'll. I think it was worth the wait. Yeah, I think I would definitely want to say to all the fans that it has been amazing to see Hey Arnold through your eyes, through this experience, and I just hope we just keep sharing adventures together. I would want to tell them to uh, dream big and um, always believe or imagine big. I guess that's what I'm trying to say: dream big, imagine big. Uh, just try to help everybody out. Um, just be kind, like Arnold. Oh. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you guys so very much for You're speaking welcome. with me today. We definitely can't wait to see all of your work in this movie. It's definitely a wonderful Thanksgiving treat coming out Friday, on Friday, November, November 24. November 24, 7 p.m. <laughs> Eastern and Pacific on Nickelodeon. Well, we can't wait to see it. Congrats to all of you guys on bringing this iconic show again back to life. And thank you guys for making such a great impact on all of our lives. The show is really, truly so influential and it was a big part of my childhood. So thank you so much again, guys. Be sure to tune in. Ciao. Peace out.